Conchetta's a terrific woman. Mm-hmm. That must have been hard on you. No, no. No, I'm fine. Oh, I know you're fine. I just didn't think it was hard. No, I think it was, it's just awkward. Um, because I'm not used to being around family. I mean, it's been Grace and I, a cozy little couple, the housekeeper makes three, and then all of a sudden brothers and sisters and yes, cousins. Yes, and Ryan, then Ryan. <laughs> the partridge in a bear tree. <laughs> well, now I'll get the swing of it. Of course you will. That's what you need now, family. If you say so. Well, of course, that's why you came home, wasn't it? I mean that and other reasons that I don't know about. There are. I mean, for one, I wanted to I wanted to bring Grace to New York to take her in a handsome cab ride all through Central Park. Yes, and let's not forget France, too. Right, and, and the Statue of Liberty and uh, the bagel shop. That's what moms are for. And then I, I want to take her to the ice skating rink at Rockefeller Center. Mm. Do you think they have ice skates that fit Grace? Oh, absolutely. And if not, my dear, in my whole closet or your old one. Oh. <laughs> Let me call you sweetheart. I'm in love. They played that song all day. The last time I was on the ice, it happened to be with your Damien son. And I don't know what it is about him. He always has to race. Even to the waltz, he was racing. Let me call you sweetheart. I'm in love with you. Why did I come home, Maeve? I don't know. Maybe I had to meet Conchetta. What is that? I think I had to check her out for myself. Because it's really important to me to see that Pat is happily married. And um, he obviously is Conchetta. Oh, what a fortunate man he is to have your love, as you have his. I have his. Darling, there's something that needs to be said. Now, I don't want to intrude, and I respect you, but it's here. Nevertheless, you know, I, I, I don't know. I'm just tired. I think. No, no. When I first laid eyes on your lovely daughter, my heart fluttered. Remember, I wanted to hear about her father. Well, if there ever comes a time when you want to talk about it, you should come to me. Who will? I miss Grace right now. Oh. I'm gonna run see her. Sure. I'll be back. Mm -hmm. Look, I wasn't being brave. I wasn't even thinking. Just opened my mouth and the truth came out. Oh, stop it. You could have lied. You know how. But you didn't. You just came right out and told me you were sniffing around the college house to look for your other. Well, that's brave. I think we should use the people's names. She's not the other. She's Ryan. Yeah, but if I would have said her name, your Sunday would have done flip-flops. And that hurts. And I'm not into hurting you. How do you know what my tummy feels like? Because I know what my tummy feels like. It gets all tied in knots whenever I hear his name. Ben's name. Well, what does this mean? I mean, every time I hear Ryan's name, I get sick. And every time you hear Ben's, you get tied up in knots. Well, it ought to mean we never want to see either one of them again. Yeah. No, even a uh, miserable talk like this works with you. You're a generous woman. Oh, yeah, well, two days ago I was a devious witch. Well, doesn't mean you can't be generous. I suppose not. Thanks. You're generous, too, you know. Gosh, how many people do you know that could actually sit across from each other eye to eye and tell the truth? I mean, gosh, this ought to be working out. Yeah, but is this us? Well... Not Ryan and Ben. I mean, truth. Truth was real far away from me and Ben when we were together. You know, he'd be so nasty to me. And I'd be calling him sweet face. And I'd be steaming open his mail. And he'd be calling me doll face. I don't get any of this. I mean, Ryan is a brat. She's uptight. She's a, she's a tease. And here you are. You're, you're sexy and you're fun. And usually cooking up something Cajun that's hot as fire, but you can't eat enough of it. But... But still, I, I hang around by the Coleridge house, freezing, to get five minutes alone with Ryan. Why? Probably for the same reason I would kill to have five minutes alone with Ben. Because we're nuts. Well, there's one answer. And 
I mean, I think we do love each other. I mean, that's real. Yeah. You know, I'm just beginning to realize how, how complicated it is to be in love. I mean, it's not like you're thirsty, so you just drink a glass of water. You know, it was like that when I was 15 years old, but now it's just... There's like five different meanings to it. You know? Fifty. There's the way you love your mama, the way you love your buddy, the way I love you. And then there's being in love. Much like being insane. Yeah. And I don't think you and me are insane together. Are you with Ben? Insane? Yeah. Well, I sure am with Ryan. We've said enough for now. You know, this really feels bad. Yeah, it does. It's me. I smell like a smoked ham. I have just been in the cave of the Havana cigars, <laughs> where all the men are playing at politics. <laughs> His slants is having a glory. Are you kidding? He is in heaven. They've got him elected and running for king now. Now, come on. That's where all the action is. We'll find a couple of gas maps. Oh, no, my dear. I'm happy here. You go on long. Did you have that cake? And then did you uh, have some protein and some veggies? Well, you look at you and listen to you. You've been gone so long, you've forgotten something. I do the mothering. You do the daughtering. Really? So does that mean that I can't ask you what's been bothering you all night? Oh, still the little girl that has to be able to read everybody's mind, right? Now listen, <laughs> if I can go all the way to Australia to take care of my mom, I certainly can come back here to oh. take care of my second mom. My sweet creature. Maeve, mm. tell me what's wrong. Oh, my dear, it's nothing that can be fixed. Certainly not tonight. So, let's leave it rest. And you? Hmm? Oh, you must be dead on your feet. Oh, you suffering from jet lag. Sit yourself down. Oh. I tell you what, I have an idea. Why don't you? You sleep in late tomorrow. And let me have my granddaughter so I can spoil her. <laughs> I don't know. She's a lot to handle these days. Oh, no, 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 no. She's only around here, and I'm used to them. Come on, now. I'd love to have her. Well, we'll see. If you're good. Lift to the cheek of the girl. <laughs> Yeah, I still can't believe that Mary has a cousin. Mm. Faith, going through the pregnancy and the childbirth all alone. You know what? What? I think the girls kind of look alike. <laughs> well, maybe part of it. Around the eyes, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> I just wished that Faith didn't live so far away. Well, you'll have to use all this time that she's here to visit. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll find plenty of time to talk. Yes, but we certainly need people who love her around her right now. That's what you're upset about. It's Faith. Well, maybe a little, yes. Yeah, you think that she should have married the baby's father. No, no, no. I just want to support her in whatever her decision is. She's been so strong and so alone. Well, it's hard for me to deal with that thing. Maeve, you know, I was a single parent. And it was hard. But it was the right thing to do at the time. And Grace and Faith, they're going to be okay. <laughs> what they need is, they need support. And all of us will do that. Mm -hmm. I just wish, no. I knew... No, no, you said yourself that we can't fix it. And she told me that she didn't want to marry the father. Oh, well, it was my understanding, dear, that it was he that didn't want to get married. Whatever. The important thing is that Grace looks around New York and she sees lots of arms, dozens of arms open to her. You know, I think we need to tear out a page from Patty's book. Patrick? Yeah. Did you see the way that he hugged that child tonight? Yes, I certainly <laughs> did see that. Well, it was instant love. 
And that's... Maybe that's all we have. That's all we have, and that's all that we can do. Is love. Oh. <laughs> oh, dear. I just hope she'll be all right. Well, you know what? We'll just remember to handle it the way Patty did. Okay? <laughs> <laughs>